Hello everyone, welcome back to the video and today I'm going to show you how to get fresh skeleton physics. Now I'm going to show you how to download it and install it from Minecraft. So if you're looking to spice up your game with more physics, this will be the video for you. Also if you want to get fresh animations, I do have a video on it and that makes all the mobs have their own fresh animations. So if you want to get that, be sure to check out the video on the screen and also linked in the description down below. But now let's get into the video. So the first thing you're going to want to do is click on the link in the description down below and it will take you to this website just here. Now this is Curse Forage and this is for the fresh skeleton physics. And this is also a resource pack, so it makes it really easy to install. So what we're going to want to do is actually come to the files icon just here, click on that. Then once you are here, scroll down. And from here, click on the three little dots on the end here, and then click on download file. Now this will take five seconds to download. And while this is downloading, if you want to get your own Minecraft server to play with your friends, be sure to check out Apex Hosting. They have some really good high quality servers, and also it does come with a DDoS protection. So you always are safe playing it on your server. So be sure to check them out with the link in the description down below. So once the download has started and now we can actually save it to a folder. For me, I'm going to pop it onto my desktop. So I'll click on my desktop and then click on save. If you don't have the option to save your file, automatically it should download to your downloads folder. But for me, I'm going to put mine on my desktop and click on save. So as you can see, I've got my fresh animations just here. So what we're going to want to do now is actually load up Minecraft. So I'm going to load up my Minecraft launcher. But before we go too far, you will need Optivine for this to work. So if you don't have Optivine, I do have a video on it and I will leave a link on the screen and also in the description down below. You do need Optivine, it is required to make these mods work or the texture pack to work. So once you have Optivine installed, simply just come down to the bottom here and make sure you select your Optivine. Now for you, it might look a little bit different in here. As you see, I've got a furnace and for you, you've probably got an Optivine logo. If that's the case, it's totally fine. It doesn't matter. Just make sure it's got Optivine in here, then click on that, then click on play. Now you might get a little warning on the screen, just click on I understand and then click on play. Once your Minecraft loads up, simply just head down to your options down here, so click on your options. Then come to resource packs, and at the bottom of this page, open pack folder, click on that. Now this will open our .minecraft folder to our resource packs. And in here, we're going to want to drag in our fresh skeleton physics. So mine here is on the desktop, I'm going to drag it into this folder just here, just like that. Now close this one out get up to your Minecraft again and as you can see we have now got it in here click on the little play button just there or the little arrow click on that that will bring it over to this side then click on done now simply we've done that go and find some skeletons and as you can see they have got their own animations and if you hit these skeletons they will actually have their own animations as you can see just like that so you keep spawning these in and as you can see they have their own types of animations here and it looks a lot better in Minecraft if this video helped you out be sure to leave a like on it also hit that subscribe button but that is it and I'll see you all in my next video.